Imported from New Guinea off the coast of Australia, the New Guinea flatworm is showing up in mid Pinellas County. Dr. Michael Ramori of the Lake Seminole Animal Hospital has heard of three cases in recent weeks. The worm itself is not a problem, it's what the worm contains, which is another parasite called the rat lungworm. The rat lungworm is bad news. If it gets into a mammal system like a person or a dog, it can cause severe problems, even paralysis and death. At the Walsingham Dog Park. I thought somebody saw one here in the park recently. Ugo's owner, David Goldberg, tells me it's hard to keep track of what he gets into. Dogs are always trying to eat something. Mm -hmm. And you try, you try to watch them most of the time, but there's always that chance that they could get something. New Guinea flatworms are non-native species. So if you see something like this, first off, don't touch it. <laughs> if you do touch it, you need to wash your hands really, really well. So far, Dr. Ramori hasn't seen any infected animals. If one does come in, treatments are limited. You can try to keep them comfortable while the worm is dying off in their system. Even using like deworming drugs that you would think would help with worms actually can increase the chance of death in dogs.